Hello, everybody, and welcome to another bombastic, fantastic evening of bad advice. Thank you all for joining us a little bit early this week. Um, we've got, hey, Asher Kojo, um, a lot going on. Uh, before Ami comes on, I just want to do some quick announcements, remind, reminding everybody that we have um, the Adventures Live Festival coming up in Nairobi, Sexual Utopia. Um, so please go to our adventuresfrom.com page, click on um, a little link that says tickets, and you can pick up tickets there. Also, we are launching our very first Adventures magazine. Um, in 2024 and we're doing a call out for submissions um, if you have had incredible life lessons that you want to share with a wider community then we invite you to pitch your stories um, so please do that and um, we also have season two of the adventures from podcasts uh, releasing on September the 18th so there is a lot that's happening uh, the look is giving Sonny a bacha, Charlie. Yeah, my edges are in dire straits and we have load shedding, hence my candle. <laughs> um, so yeah, those are some um, big things coming up. Please follow on our page. Um, newsletter. Um, so yeah, subscribe to that as well and then you can be kept uh, abreast, abreast of all the things that are happening in the... <laughs> Lands of adventures. I didn't mean to laugh. <laughs> My I did not intend to. I was not prepared. <laughs> Last all we. I, I was not prepared for this look today, but based on the questions, I was like, "There's a lot that's happening." <clears throat> you can understand. I, I understand. Based on the questions that we received this week, there is a lot that is happening, and I understand the the much that is happening. Yeah. with your look. Exactly. Yes. It's giving flower girl marriage counselor. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Um, hey, Minister Society, greetings. Hey, Astro Kojo, as usual. <laughs> um, hey, Abna Asante, welcome back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Do okay. you have, what's your drink this evening? Oh, today, Wara. Wara, today for me is Jackal's Vly. My dear. I haven't even drunk my coffee yet. It's too early to start doing alcohol. <laughs> it's early for you. As you can see, for me, it's very, very late. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not invoking the ancestors, please. It's doing so in my, in oh, my land. So. Yeah, I would have. Ah, shameless. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Farm Soup. Welcome. Yeah. Y'all. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I'll be interested to see which, which one of the questions inspired this ad. Uh, We've got orange, we've got yellow, we've got purple. Do I see blonde underneath there? Did you change your hair? Yes, I do. Oh. Okay, all right. Hmm. That's being said, mm -hmm. we are at the 34 minute mark. Are we ready? Yes. Oh, let's do the honest disclaimer. Disclaimers. Disclaimer. Yeah, I don't have energy. I don't have energy to scream. The weather has been wet during me. Please, if you are not 18, move your body from here. In fact, your spirit should not even be here. If you are here, you come and hear something, you go and do it, and something happens, it's your own business. It's you and your family that will deal with it. Please, you are welcome to join us at any time. There's a camera looking thing with a cross in there. You know that thing that they put Jesus Christ on? Yes, it looks like camera. <laughs> Push it. Your face will do circle, one, 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 and then you add, you come and join us, and then we'll have a conversation. Put your comments in there. And of course, don't forget to follow Adventures on every social media platform. Everyone. You know saying? Everywhere, everywhere. In your textbooks, on your, in your bank statements, um, you know, your investment accounts, everywhere. Follow us. Yes. <laughs> Bet on us. You're about to Bet on us. Thank Bet you. on we. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. All, All right. right. Question number one. Hmm. Hence the Duke. I'm newly married. My husband and I began having sex before marriage, but it was always some quick smashing in a car because there's no privacy in this Accra. Now that we're married, I had hoped that we would engage in more foreplay, but it seems as though he's used to effing me for five minutes and rolling over. How can I get him to put more effort and romance into our sex? 
This one I read it when I read it. I said, hey, boxy banga. Mm -hmm. <laughs> VW banga. Hmm. Hmm. Quick action. Quick action. Capitalist action. economist banga. Boop, boop, boop. You dis. Boop, 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 banga. Exactly. Quick turn Express services. Express round. Mm -hmm. One round, we are done. You understand? Round, we are done. You understand? You understand? understand. No wasting of time. Huh? Concise banga. Efficient banga. You understand? My dear. We only have five minutes banga. You only know your what I'm saying? We are on Maximize the clock banga. Maximizing use of time banga. <laughs> 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 Sure banka banga. Sure banka banga, dear. Sure banka banga. <laughs> Ashley <laughs> Kutcher said a car is private in Accra. Ah. Ah. Private I car know. banga. Private car banga. <laughs> Tinted windows you, banga. You know? <laughs> <laughs> collect or uh, driver, collect one CD. Police man, collect one CD banga. Drive through drive banga. banga. Drive through banga, dear. Drive through banga. <laughs> mm? Oh my God! What do they call it here? We have Mr. D. Do you have Mr. D? Like our, like we have Mr. D, which which is funny, right? Mr. D is this delivery guy, and he goes around to all the different shops and restaurants, and he delivers your food. So Mr. D Banga. Mm -mm, no, ours is both both food Uber Uber delivery, Korean Banga. Korean <laughs> Banga. <laughs> hey, in the whole of Accra. There's no privacy. My dear, you've been bamboozled. Ah. Yango, Yango Banga, Yang Yango Banga. 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 There's no privacy. Wait, how long were you guys dating for? Me, to me, to me, this sounds like a very, very young couple, right? Like maybe early 20s. The guy has never left his parents' house, you know, same for the girl or whatever. So in that case, I can understand. Like, mm -hmm. you're in your parents' house and there's no privacy. But the yeah. whole of a crowd, you couldn't save some of your, your student stipend. I'm sure these people get something. Like something. 50 CDs. What? Because you can't marry if you are broke. You cannot marry if you are broke. Although some people do. I know of one couple where they are living in yeah. the white father's house. But even, the, I mean, it's, it's a whole mess. I, I don't want to tell too much about them so that people might know their business, but it's a whole entire mess. Ooh. So in that case, you, you know, obviously, mm -hmm. <laughs> there's no privacy in your father-in-law's house. Your, but still, privacy. it's a house. With your price, price, you know, hotel is cheaper. Hotel is cheaper. <laughs> it's true. Like, so you're trying to say you did not give yourself a chance to go to a hotel, even if, sacrifice bed bugs, you, you know, just, just to get experience. I don't understand people who are like, oh, we were fucking this way before we got married and now you're expecting something different. Are you mad? You can't expect something different you after can't marriage. Something different. No. Just because you jumped the broom and brought some snaps doesn't mean the sex is going to be different. Like Exactly. It's, exactly it's my dear i hate to break it to you but this one dear there's never going to be any romance because you have accepted this from the beginning and that you can just be a backseat banger back in banger, car, back banger but like like he's broke so, so whose car are you banging in imagine you lend somebody your car and you come back it's like bro what is this stain what like what is this uh, bodily fluids banger. it's booty juices all in my back seat Booty Judas Bali food is banga. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, seriously, maybe he even married you because you are you are efficient, you are an efficient use of his time. So who's he romancing? I don't know. Maybe he doesn't romance. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Efficient use of the time. Because if he's young, right? Charlie, the economy is not economized. He has to go make the very, money. Very so you know, if I don't have to spend 30 minutes to an hour, maybe two hours, all day sex kind of thing. Okay, but I know, oh, my woman understands. Five minutes, boom, we're done. Five minutes, boom, we're done. done. You know? Newlywed nuts. Newlywed. Not and then you're, now you're, you, you want romance and foreplay. You didn't think of romance and foreplay when you were doing...
Okay, in the replay, nobody's going to be able to see this response. Yes. But Farm Soup said, different kind of skidding on the road. <laughs> I'm sorry, we have to pull it together. <laughs> Just like, did they even have an AC? Oh, of course, they don't have an AC. That's why it's five minutes. It was AC, it would like take a little longer. True, because the cold and the erection will not. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to steam. You have to steam your way through it. And you have to steam your way through it in this yeah. Accra. You park. Yeah. And Accra is not a clean city. Like it's not. It's not a clean. Like it's not like you're you're banging in. I don't know Tokyo. Where, no, you know, no there, are pl there are places, Malika. There are places. Where? Listen, I have Where? had our, I have had like a good amount of time with ample opportunity to fornicate some place being Accra. Was it in the backseat of a car? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> but so it was open that. air. It was open air to justify that there are places in this Accra <laughs> at the right time of the day. My dear, it just sounds like your husband doesn't does has has categorized you it as whether we are married cry, we are dating cry, we are whatever cry. It's it's always going to be you're never yeah. going to get the romance. Yeah, no, no, no. We, no, we don't no, have no. advice for you. No, nah, we don't have advice for you. My dear. My, okay, so, but how can she okay, so how can she incorporate some romance or add, get him to incorporate some romance? The only way to say, like to insult his game was like I'm not coming. You know the people are announcing I'm coming. I'm coming. Mm -hmm. You have to announce I'm not coming. I'm not I, coming. I mean, not, she never even said anything about her coming because that's five minutes. It's like pa, 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 pa. it's like the machine gun. You're finished. What about you? He's finished. He's finished. You will never finish. You will never arrive. So, even from the beginning, your pleasure was not even like. Astro get it with prep time of thirty minutes and it wasn't even in the you see what I'm saying, Astro Kojo? You see what I'm saying? Ah You understand? Prep time. At least the prep time. time. You know? <laughs> and then you in, in the middle of vacation, you go on commercial break, food break, and then you come back. <laughs> he can come back. <laughs> you know, we go here our sponsors, the lubrication <laughs> providers. <laughs> Durex and co. You know? Shall we read some of our um, advice troll yes. responses? It okay. said, <laughs> "Skull emoji, skull emoji." There's no privacy in the whole of our crowd. Just so crazy. <laughs> what the fuck? Laughing, laughing, laughing. Bye. Somebody else said, "Hotels, guest houses, movie houses. Still no privacy. Privacy in our crowd." And you believed it. And that's the other thing. She believes this man. She be believes it. And okay, so it sounds like he's experienced and she's not so experienced. Mm -hmm yes that's the problem like he's I been did. doing this he's been like efficient banging for decades or however long <laughs> and he's found his his, his fool a fool enough to marry him musical interlude oh god <laughs> so they're just walking through the forest <laughs> Words so wicked. Words so wicked. <laughs> Why is the heart so evil? We gotta move on. <laughs> yes. I choose this song specifically <laughs> for this week. You said, Why is the world so wicked? <laughs> Why is the heart so evil? <laughs> Next Please, question. <laughs> cousin just introduced his new girlfriend at a family function this question had me hollering he told oh, us privately that he's considering proposing to her because he's certain she's the one the problem is that i know this girl is gay like gay gay uppercase i hooked up with her in the past how do i tell my cousin about this girl without outing myself i haven't come out to my family yet <laughs> Why? Why is the world so wicked? <laughs> Why is the heart so evil? <laughs> Me, my first question is, Madam, is it your own? Exactly. Sexuality is fluid. It's like fluid. What? Like why? She was gay. She was gay yesterday. Mm -hmm. She's not gay today. Mm -hmm. Yesterday. What was? What does that mean? Yesterday was yesterday. Yesterday. Today is, today. is gone. 
and another day has come she's doing something new in your family's life <laughs> <laughs> yesterday she was gay today, today she may be bi she mm -hmm. she and she may be bi doing... you see mm -hmm. this is bi erasure from the queer community you know i i, I i'm not queer everybody knows you know mm -hmm. but like i've heard my queer queer friends talk about you know by erasure and you know and i'm like this is a clear example this girl could be bi who you what's her problem mm -hmm. how do you know she's gay gay you know are you in her pants at all times? you understand are you are you in her chromosomes are you the molecular elements moving through her pineal glands her and... pineal glands her pussy glands you're not there you one exactly Asha Kojo said, gay today, gone tomorrow. Yeah. But see, but like, why, 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 why is that your business? So maybe she had, she had like her taste buds have changed. She had a thing right. for, for, for coochie, you know, and then maybe some, somebody dicked her so well. And you know, your now cousin. she's like 70, you guys, she's 75% dicking right. and she's going to marry, you know, my dear, my dear. Marry. 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 And, and cry, uh, maybe your cousin knows. And he's completely fine with it. You don't know what the arrangement is. Exactly. You don't know what the two of them are doing for exactly. each other. Don't be a devil. Don't let the devil use you. Don't use become you. an unfortunate human being. <laughs> <laughs> she said gay gay. Mm -hmm. Me is a gay gay. Gay gay. Gay gay. President of gay affairs, you this. <laughs> he salutes you. Gay prefect. I know. Gay identifier. Uh, identifier. <laughs> And she too, she's the gay police. You understand? I feel like she's not over this girl. She's not over the girl. Hey, that's don't, the problem. No duo. She chopped you, Papa. Hey, that means she like she turned her she, out. Oh, like the girl was, was already she, gay. She did you so well for it to actually I start working. She really did you. Hey. Oh no, my dear, you should be you should be going for um deliverance or something like that because <laughs> it's like imagine when she's over there at the top of the aisle with your cousin they are saying their vows your cousin is being ridiculously emotional because he's married a lot of his life and all you can think about is how you were calling this girl's name when she was turning you the fuck out out you're going what, to help what i think she should do since she doesn't want to out herself is take a pair of panties and like throw it at the next family function if she catches the panties then we all know she's gay. The cousin knows she's gay. If she is, then you know. But what if, like, who, 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 as who threw the panty? Why are you throwing the panties? Panty it doesn't drop. matter. Like, yeah, it's like, you know, if she's like gay, gay, she's gonna be like, oh, panties. The way she's saying the gay, gay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, it's not regular, regular gay. My dear, this person should go and join a convert because clearly she's not over this one and it looks like her feelings are getting... Because you know the queer community, we are very, very emotional. Um, very, no. very, It's a very, very emotional community. No, but this girl is wrong because she doesn't want to out herself. She's like, I haven't come out to my family, but you want to out somebody else. Why is the heart so weekend? Where's this? Why can she <laughs> Where will she go? Where will she go? <laughs> Life is misery. <laughs> Life is misery. Mm -mm. Misery. Yeah. So Life let's see what our advice trolls have to say. Um, the first one is, mind your business? <laughs> what if she was gay, gay, and now she's straight, straight? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she buy. Have you considered that? You know? And you hooked up. It wasn't like you guys were in a relationship. But you hooked up. You Maybe in the back, back seat of a car for five minutes. You know, for five minutes. Efficient hook up. No, actually, Mr. You know, hook up. Like, we, like the, the queer, like, I, I give us credits, though. I think five minutes is a little insulting to the community. Oh, no. Like, I've never heard of a queer couple like just hooking up for fun like i've never yeah, ever, ever no 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 it's it's no no that, I mean, I, that's one thing that. that i'll give y'all like you plan and you take your time and we are not just like you know just yeah, yeah. i'll give that to y'all 
even, 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 even quickies are like hetero food sessions <laughs> you know yeah 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 i love it for y'all i really yeah. do but it's not your job to tell him what if he knows and they just want to marry to fulfill a society obligation she should tell her herself you know what i'm saying simple and short yes think about how you come out to your family if you want to come out to Ooh. your family Ooh. how should she come out to her family maybe the gay gay should throw the pants at her yeah or she should, on, on their wedding day she should play I'm coming I'm coming out. and then make sure like she has all the colors unless the family know exactly what the colors have to do with it they'll be like is she okay is she okay is she doing well is she doing well? what is this rainbow best did she smoke something see this is why i tell you don't smoke weed drugs are bad what if, after, smoke weed. Just say, what if after you're out they still get married and now the folks know you're a hater not only are they going to know you know you're a hater they're also going to cast and bind the devil of the woman of their gaze <laughs> of, the, of, of the gay gays of the gay of the gay gays of the gay gays of the gay but, gays but if she's gay gay and she's still married a straight straight man then you are gay 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 then gay, you are gay, the gay 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 yeah it's a whole yes. conundrum mm, my dear worry about your life worry about your mm -hmm. own life mm. are we ready to proceed yes. i started dating a guy about six months ago he's the total package Did good she? job god fearing great body fantastic sex the only problem is that he has two kids that he has full custody of mm -hmm. he wants me to be kids as it's getting kind of serious between us but i hate kids hates with capital letters there's nothing wonderful about children in my opinion now i'm stuck because i don't want to let go of a good thing if i could just wait for them to turn 18 and leave what's my next move don't wait for them to turn 18. You leave, bitch. I mean, <laughs> clearly, <laughs> it's like she has got to catch. This is, like some, this, this is like some Cinderella story that I'm seeing. This is Cinderella story. My dear, you might have to own your wicked stepmother, Rolo. Completely. And get them to get the kids taken to boarding school. But why does he have full custody of the kids? Well, maybe their mama wasn't mummering enough. Okay. So yeah, that would be if you really want this man, and let's be honest, there's no way you can get rid of the kids. So find a way to get their kids to boarding school. It's true. Oh, this is wonderful bad advice. Yeah. Go full step mother mode. Yeah. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, not Disney stepmother. What was the, Hans Christian Anderson? Yeah, that kind of step. Yeah, yeah. like yeah. lock the children in the basement and only let them out when the dad comes home. Like, you that's, know, that's right. We actually had a babysitter do that to our kids, girl. And I had no idea. I feel so bad, kids. If you're watching, mommy, sorry, mommy never knew. In the heat of Atlanta summer, this woman locked my children out of the house because they were making too much noise. And it's like we came home like at the same time every day and like maybe 10 minutes before we got home she would let them in my kids in the streets <laughs> she, she hated kids <laughs> so Whoa. my dear take take a page out of my babysitter's book yeah yeah just, just go full-blown step mom on them marry the man marry the man marry the man get the great and sex. then go and then go full-blown marry the man get pregnant Ooh. Get pregnant. Oh, no, 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 no. But she hates kids. She no, so get pregnant. get pregnant and then miscarry. Miscarry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. A little bit of, like, pig's blood, you know. Oh, mm -hmm. my God. Oh, this is terrible this is, advice. This is terrible it's advice. Situation. Just find, sacrifice your, like, your nearest goats, right? Yeah. Pour the entrails all over the bathroom floor and be like, oh, my God, I'm miscarry. He'll ship the children off to wherever, and then you have to Yeah, run. because you're like, you need you need time to emotional trauma things so the kids can be here and then be traumatized long enough so the kids can stay in boarding school yeah 
Salem wants to know what we're talking about. Hey, Salem. So um, just to catch you up, this lady started dating a guy about six months ago. He's like, how do you know you're ready to marry this man after six months? Are you mad? I know, six right? Six months, great job, great sex, God-fearing. He has two kids, but she hates kids. Yeah. Um, and she wants to know what her next move is. Me, the first thing I said is your next move is to get a fuck. Yeah, no, but I was like, don't get a fuck because, you know, the economy is hard to find someone that's true. Mm -hmm. The package, finding package is difficult because all these app packages that are being delivered, you look under a rat has chew under the uh, package. But they are banging for five minutes in the backseat. Exactly. For five minutes in the backseat. So just go into full blown step, evil step mother mode. You are going to have to be a combination of Ursula and what's Cruella, mm -hmm. all the Ellas all the Disney movies, and then Patience or Zorko. <laughs> um, <laughs> yes, add Patience. Add, 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 Add a sprinkle. We can't do too much patience with Zorko because the children will die and the husband will die. So just enough of patience with Zorko in the mix, you know. And then you add mental health therapy, language, trauma, shit, shit, traumatic their head to it, so that yes, you get them into boarding school or military school. So yeah. they, yes, uh -huh. mm -hmm. yes, 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 yes. says time to cash out with some ritual sacrifice. Exactly. Exactly. Make sure you go to your nearest babalao or your nearest priest for fortification yeah. to so that the kayamata kayamates. Your nearest mama Odi. Little yeah. little deep. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Exactly. So that's the only thing. That's Marry the dude. Marry the dude. Yes. You know. And then yes. maybe de develop allergies to something about the children to a medical condition. Yeah. yeah. And if he's like, you know. Well, the thing is, I don't know if he's ready to marry her because she's like, he's the total package. But is she the total package? What are you bringing to the table, my dear? It's like, my dear, I have the whole kitchen. There's a table in the kitchen. There's a table in the kitchen. <laughs> hey. The grief sex after you kill the kids will be good. <laughs> oh, I should go to the grief sex after you kill the kids will be good. <laughs> <laughs> because why should the children keep you from the love of your life? <laughs> what if fuck these kids? <laughs> Quote Michael Jordan. <laughs> True. Why should children keep you from the love of your life? Yes. Yes. Comfort him with titties with and cookie and booty. Yes. Oh, honey. It shall be well, oh It shall be well, Mr. It shall be well. I hope you don't have small titties like me. So that when he puts his head in between, like, it's so so, his yes, like, his head will, like, feel the comfort of the bosom of you. <laughs> of, of, of you. Please, are you ready to go on to the next question? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Next question said. <laughs> Wait, that's what we're supposed to i'm sorry we're supposed to reset the room everybody if you have any advice that you would like to give live please hit the little camera with the plus sign we will happily join you bring you in as a co-host um for bad advice if you have it like whether if you want to go back to the first question or this particular question please feel free to join us mm -hmm. we are here for you you are here for yes. us madame mm -hmm. take it away this is also one of the reasons why i've colored me like this because it makes sense now it makes sense yeah. we are ready take, take it away take it away my girlfriend has no social graces which is one of the things i find most intriguing about her but at the same time i'm sick of getting kicked out of clubs and restaurants because she's loud and ready to fight my dear sick of food <laughs> My company is sponsoring a holiday getaway for all the staff and our SOs on the three-day crew. What's and our SO, significant others on a three-day cruise? Three day I can't imagine taking my feral girlfriend. Am I a dick? Oh, no. Sorry, go on. <laughs> Am I a dick if I leave her behind and go alone? Leave who behind? <laughs> leave who behind? <laughs> leave who behind where? Are you mad? Do you want to On die? Why want to die? Yo? It's not be me. Leave who are we acting? Me, out? you are going on this cruise, though. Ah, cruise that they have paid for. Are we acting it out? Uh, yes, now. Nah. Are we ready to act? Okay. Obviously, we know who you are. Yes, then. What's your own? Look. 
Um, hey, babe. Hey, what's up? Hey. Um, I really enjoyed dinner with you last night, um, except for when you threw the lobster tail at the waiter. I don't, I don't really think that was necessary. Did you want me to throw the lobster tail at you? I, I didn't want it thrown at all. Um, I'm just, you know, but it, that, that brings me to today's conversation. Um, wait, 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 before I get to today's conversation. So you were sitting there, she was talking to me anyhow. You want me to be, just be there someone to talk to you anyhow? <laughs> hey! No, sweetie. I mean, she wasn't talking to you anyhow. She just asked you if the butter sauce was okay. And you said, but these nuts. And I just thought that, you know, you kind of escalated it further. You're supposed to ask me a question. Bring the food. Bring the butter sauce. Leave the food. Go away. What are you doing over here? Yeah. Um, I really do think she was just trying to help. I don't think she was trying to disrespect you. Anyway, um, the company has... Um, <laughs> and I, I just want to gauge how you're feeling about this, right? Mm -hmm. um, the company is taking everybody um, on a cruise, and I was wondering if you would be okay. Oh, yes, I love to come. If you would be okay staying at home, because it could be like a working kind of situation where you know we're working through some things, like we're working, Fisherman. right? Fisherman, when do you start working on a ship? But I'm saying, when did you start working? On, when did your job description start saying catching fish on the sea? But what I'm, I'm saying, love, babe, honey, mm -hmm. is that I would, I would, I would love for you to come, right? Uh -huh. um, but I just think that given the lobster situation, uh -huh. that maybe you don't even like seafood like that, and so maybe My you, dear, you might be the 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 oh, what's the name of that foolish girl? The waiter disrespected me, so she had this coming for her. Since your job description did not say you're on the sea, you're not a fisherman, you're not in the navy. I'm coming to this thing, no. I'm coming to this thing. If you like shit fire, I'll come to this thing. Unless you want, unless you want, you want one of us to die. In fact, no, unless you want all the people going on that cruise to die. Make your <laughs> choice. Nigga, why are they gonna die? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I broke character. <laughs> Um, well, I, I I guess you're coming then. Pizza! Um, What's that even a question? Anyway, so, uh, what are we wearing? <laughs> <laughs> My friend, leave that hoe. Leave that crazy hoe at home. <laughs> leave her at home. <laughs> no. All, Go on. Why would you even tell her? Like, don't even tell her. A three uh, cruise. What? Can you imagine? What? find out and mind you guys are on the sea you oh, the sea you turn you become under the sea <laughs> <laughs> under the sebastian will actually find you under the sea sebastian will be chewing what's remaining of yeah. you <laughs> yeah no i mean like imagine three days on a boat in the middle of nowhere tell her you're going to the village <laughs> she wants to come she'll no, come no. along no no she can't come to the village no Big old boat, middle of the ocean. Everybody on there is stressed. All the wait staff is stressed. And there's you throwing lobster tails and napkins and flipping tables and yeah, leave her. No, but wait, so me, that's thing that's over me when I read it. It wasn't even about the throwing thing. He's, she said, my girlfriend has no social graces, which is one of the things I find most intriguing about it. You're attracted to it now, so why you are you complaining? You are attracted to the madness, but then he called her feral. That was so disrespectful. <laughs> he called Why are you complaining now? now? <laughs> and but the thing is, these, these quiet guys love these loud, crazy ass girls. They love them. Yes, the ones that be patting their weaves. Yeah. Because when it's time for the waitress to bring the, the like the melted butter and the butter sauce, he's not going to speak up. He's looking for Farragut to say something. Eh, eh, uh, uh, I said we need some butter over here. Yeah. Yeah, but then it's like yeah. then respectability, res respectability. The English are finished. Respectability politics. Now because you are going on cruise, you are going on push. My dear, you will carry her. You will go. Carry you will. Her. You will go with her. It is for better or worse. Still, <laughs> you will be good. <laughs> Which girlfriend is better or worse? For Your better or worse. worse. Or worse. <laughs> or worse. Yes, we are go. Because if right now, if right now somebody starts spraying bullets. 
you want this girl to cut literally she listen this is the kind of girlfriend that if, if someone pulls up with a gun she might literally cuss them out and the person will have low self-esteem and they might go away don't even rob you again it's, so it, that's it that's it that is works so she stood with you in the walks for all yeah. you know you guys went to the restaurants and then they brought they brought the wrong order because it was <laughs> your own order that they brought you and then she's fighting your fights for you for now you. you are going on cruise you are going to be on top of shit on sea with with um ah uh, they'll, they'll fire you then they'll so fire he you he knows her behavior will get him fired at work you you you, you will be fired you will be fired <laughs> you'll be fired but you'll be fired because she, she's coming with you in fact why is what girl well whoever you are dm me let's start packing your bags in fact just quit your job yes just quit ah quit. yeah Quit, quit like you release your soul the same thing you're intrigued by now you're asking us question about yeah uh, are you okay? so strange. yeah i thought she was dancing azonto no 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 that no, one no, no. is better mm -hmm. this girl's keep people out fighting flipping tables but yeah I, he just okay so my dear our advice is to you is to quit your job mm -hmm. quit immediately release any source of income um yeah because your your options are either to take her and be completely embarrassed or yeah like just destroy the rest of your life i recommend destroying the rest of your life because that's true oh you know what you know when we gave someone advice to break your body parts like be sick so that you can't go so then you can't you don't go to the cruise eh, so yeah. if you don't eh. yeah yeah so if you a little bit of milk you'll be on the toilet for a couple of days you know and it has to be like the night before the cruise like so yeah tell her tell her oh babe you know this cruise blah blah blah. get her so excited you know blah blah blah. and then like did you see the the plane mm. that had to reroute back to delta um atlanta the delta plane somebody was shitting from like the front of the plane to the back yeah it was like last week everybody in the on the live google it a delta plane had to reroute and go back to atlanta because it was a bio biohazard somebody started shitting from the gates to their seats that's what you need to do maybe reroute reroute out the whole and then the whole company can't go because everybody's on the same plane and now nobody can go and we've missed like you know the port of call and everything that's my mm. advice drink some dirty ass milk shit all over the plane and Ooh. yeah save save your relationship and save your job yeah uh, it's a win you but you're mm -hmm. but what what if they're like driving distance to the port right so she, he doesn't they don't have to get on a plane right and so what can happen now is ooh, it can be one of two things you start shitting which means you can't go but uh if i was the girl if you are feeling sick i'm like oh baby i'm so sorry i'll get you a nanny um tell the people that i'll come in your stead so <laughs> <She's a nanny. laughs> to be changing your diaper <laughs> yes just so that you don't miss anything from the meeting so i'll attend it for you okay this is brilliant or get her on a different cruise ship, then you can say she made a mistake. Ooh. And when you do that, make sure you've also written your will. <laughs> Cause she gonna kill you. Yeah. Look at look at her eyelashes. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. what, what normal woman puts yellow and orange on her eyebrows or whatever? What is this eyelid? Eyelid. Yeah, she gonna kill you. But I think it's the right thing to do. Yeah. Ash, Joe, thank you. As usual, you've come through. Someone has at the company you see what i'm saying hey and in that case if she misbehaves they won't hold it against you because mm -hmm. you were not there you were not there and she wasn't there either because she was on a different boat mm -hmm. please we have to move along yes last question oh did we read our responses from uh, uh our advice oh, yeah, no no we haven't so it said um yeah oh let's go back to the other one with the baby like the baby daddy situation okay it's the, the troll said your next move is to move on his children are an important part of him so if you can't do it you better leave mm -hmm. and um someone said how the fuck is he a perfect guy with two kids where where they mama at where he got full custody and not their mama you should be way way worried <laughs> yeah where is the mama did he kill the mama because this sounds like some murder shit okay chucky we see you yeah we see um <laughs> Mm -hmm. so, so this mm -hmm. one said <laughs> the one we we're talking about my girlfriend has no social graces so you get attacked by terrorists they need a ghetto ass atomic blonde weed bitch to save the day is that not what i said is that not what i said 
then. Is that what I said? Why they say atomic blonde bitch? <laughs> and I'm imagining blonde too. Very, not regular blonde though. Atomic and you are blonde. Like you can't be an actor today. My God. <laughs> I was okay. I am. I am. I am. Yeah. If, if it wasn't for certain things in this thing, I'll say somebody's writing about me, but it's not me. <laughs> it's not. I, I, I know it's not me. <laughs> All right, is everybody ready for question number five? Let's see some flames, flames. in the chat. Please fire this house for us. Fire this house for us. Fire for question number fire five. Question. Number five. All Ooh. right. <clears throat> I, recently, I recently discovered that my partner has been posing as a fake entity on social media, on a social media platform to interact with me. He wanted to tell <laughs> I'm sorry, this, this dumb nigga. <laughs> He wanted to test to see if I truly loved him for who he is. I feel betrayed and confused about his intentions because what nonsense is this? We've been together for five years and it's now that you want to see if I truly love you. What is it about five years? Do you remember like a couple weeks ago, this guy was like, my, yeah. My, my girlfriend of five years, I got to ring for someone five, else. <laughs> what is it with niggas in five years? All right, so he wants she, he wants to test and see if I truly love you. So a social media site. I mean, is it Grinder? Is it you know like what are the social media sites? Like which sites? Is it Instagram? Where are um, people messaging? Instagram, Twitter, uh, Twitter Facebook. Twitter. If you guys are on Facebook, it'll be some weird. It'll be some weird, Papa. Yeah. Be Y'all are old and like you're too old to be like pulling this shit. Like y'all yeah. are too old to play. or at least he should be if you're on Facebook. Mm -hmm. And then and what else? Tumblr. Who uses Tumblr? I've never I've never ever used Tumblr in my life. I have an account. I have a Marco Polo account. They just messaged me and they were like, Yeah, you haven't used it since like 2012. I'm like, I didn't know I had this shit. Like, why are you messaging me? It's been eleven years. Yeah, delete it. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Clearly not you. Nah, man. Nah, so, man. the boy is, like, your boyfriend is trying to catfish you. Yes. On a social, social media site. To see if you truly love him. Now, wait, so did this guy come into some money? Yes. This guy came into some money. So, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, you know, we have to musical. I need to continue this musical interview for this. <laughs> Cause, cause I don't get it. I don't get it. Because if you just came into some money, and you've been poor for so the Yeah, this is truly a Nollywood film. Yeah. All of a sudden, after five years, now you want to test if somebody loves you. When we're eating Gary and you had to count the granola steak and count on one hand. That you when you were banging me for five minutes, for five in, the minutes back of in the car. back of the car. Bangar that wasn't love for you. Efficient Bangaru. Yango Banga. Yango Banga. The Yango Banga. Mm -hmm. Banga. Mm -hmm. Uba Sheets. <laughs> Uba <laughs> now, after five years, you want to now you want to test my love I dude you know what I, I i i am actually going to admit that i am this is beyond this is beyond me like i can't even think of a scenario i can't think of like really audience i'm really depending on you because i'm truly confused why after five years i can understand six months but like if you suddenly came into my like if i've been with you for five years and you're broke and now you suddenly come into some money he said no. She has yeah, to go so, for you know, ooh, honestly, all these stories, I feel like they connect because you know, like, <laughs> so this, this, like, you know, the people who are five, the five minute banging, and then the zero, the zero cat, um, you know, like their stories should intertwine. Zero, atomic blonde bitch. Atomic please. blonde bad bitch. <laughs> they all, they definitely, there is a common thread. 
And the common thread is the madness of men. Oh, yeah. Salem said, just talk shit about your boyfriend. Please, yes, just talk shit. Like, just, not that you know that it's him. Talk shit. Like, yeah. hey, yeah. degrade him. Degrade yeah. him on that social media platform. Tell him that. Yeah. In fact, and then talk about how small his penis is and he thinks he's doing that thing. Only five minutes. Only five and you're not satisfied in this life. Mm -hmm. And what I want you to do is, while you're doing that, uh, have maybe set a, like while you're having, while you're chatting with the person on social media, set a camera so that you're recording your reaction because you know that you are, you are being silly. So that when, when, when your, your boyfriend decides to act a fool and confront you about today, you show him evidence and tell him like, oh, Chassie, your father, <laughs> your father, micro -queenies. yeah, micro -queenies. It's true. Yeah. Talk shit about him to him. Talk shit about him to him. I bet you want. His breath is stinky. His breath is stinky. He has body odor. You don't even know how you've survived it till now. Oh, you know, you're just managing no. him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're yeah, just managing him. And you've actually been you've actually there's this there this there's this, you know, this this sponsor somewhere and mention some European country that you know that he wants to go to. <laughs> Barcelona. You know, that he's willing to take you on vacation. Tell him like exactly, just tell the lies. I mean, he wants the information. Lies. He wants the tea. Give him the Give him that tea with sugar and lots of milk. From this, and make sure he's lactose intolerant. Yes. Make sure he's got diabetes. Kill him. Kill him. He wants. He wants, he wants to die. Him. This Give is him. the thing. He wants to die. Kill him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. You say you've just been there for his money. You knew that he was going to blow, so you've just been patiently waiting for him to blow. To just exactly. blow. Exactly. Yeah. It's true he wants to die. So, my dear, our advice is to speed up the process. Him. Speed up the process. Speed up the process. Mm -hmm. I'm dating you for five years. And I want to test university, <clears throat> or I don't know how old these people are. Let's say high school. That's like a whole, like, that's end of high school, end of university, first job, like going into like beyond entry level to like middle, like middle management, whatever it is. Like, it's too long for us to be playing these games. Yes. Kill him slowly. Yeah. Yes. Confusing. Give him mental health crisis. Yes. Abi has my and I'm for insurance I'm now. Talking shit about him. Come back to the bedroom and give him like hot sex so Ex that he's just confused. Exactly. Confuses existence. He will drive <laughs> himself mad. 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 <laughs> Make sure the sex is absolutely like, wild and then they talk shit about him like, himself. Yeah, all the in fact, stuff get get a yoga gym membership. Stretch out like stretch out. I don't know if you know the thing that they have on there's a category called soul snatching in porn. Snatch his soul. Yeah, man. Snatch his soul. Hey, you the style baby. <laughs> <laughs> Reverse cowgirl, cowgirl, upside down, crucifix. <laughs> no, there's like a move. It's like a kegel move where like you just kind of like clinch it and yes. it. Yes. Yeah. Keyhole, keyhole. Keyhole, keyhole. <laughs> keyhole. <laughs> so snatch. So you For touch less it to him and then at night you, you snatch the living life out of his existence. Yeah. And then you continue. And then like, go to your phone, pick up your phone and like go to the DMs where he's been DMing you and begin to DM. Like, yeah. Talk shit about mm -hmm. the session. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> people, 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 people like to use their own hand to fetch Omo and pour it in their eyes. <laughs> you are using your own hand to Fetch omo and pour it in your rice, and then you add Clorox bleach to it, and say you're yeah, making rice water. Rice water. <laughs> rice water because it's white. Now nah, it's rice water. Exactly. Imagine. My dear. My dear. Give you Have fun with it. Have fun with it for months. Have fun for with it for months. Months. For months. Months. Yeah. Yeah. Don't don't make it like a short process. Mm -mm. Carry on. Oh, because enjoy. It's been here. It's like entertainment. This is entertainment, oh, my dear. Free entertainment. Ah, you don't have to go to the movies again. Big. Ah, you know. And it's not. It's, and don't just chop him at night. He just gets back from work. You see. Oh, there. No, you have some hot laundry on. You are playing. Let me sit this air, Sonia. Hey, hey. When he's dirty, when he least expected, when he's stinky and 
dirty. Like he's just come back from the gym. Now some women do love the smell and taste of their man after they've, they've come back from the gym. I'm not one of those women. Go take a shower. But yeah, confuse him. Exactly. And then go straight to her phone and begin yes. to DM, like in his face. Think of new ways to be with you. In fact, make it your full-time job. Your full-time your full job. <laughs> full-time job to frustrate this man's life. And then send him on a cruise. <laughs> <laughs> By his lonesome. By his so lonesome. you can imagine not being there with you and he's still chatting with you. Oh my god. <laughs> he wants trouble. Give it to him. Salem said every day, think of new ways to be exactly. with you. It's true. <clears throat> exactly exactly yep. because i don't understand how you decide to complicate your life this way you've got a good woman mm -hmm. she's still with you five the years in this economy uh, five years okay. okay she says i feel betrayed and confused about his intentions what are his intentions my dear we don't know his intentions so so then confuse his intentions so we're <laughs> both confused in the relationship <laughs> Nonsense is this? <laughs> yeah. So if you're confused, confuse him too. So not two of you are two confused people in a confusing relationship. A confusion ship. It's the confusion ship at that point. Ship. It's not a we have situation ships, and this is a confusion ship. This is a confusion ship. Then the two of you can be here. Can be here, and then you can go on a cruise ship. Exactly. With your confusion. With the confusion. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We've solved your problem. We've solved your problem for you. Mm -hmm. My dear, I want to ask you which of these questions were the most the most bombastic in your opinion ah my dear this is a combination of um streets meets a um, marriage counselor like the whole <laughs> fit is i wish i could show you the whole outfit is like street meets marriage counselor. <laughs> yes <laughs> yes floral on the bottom feral on top <laughs> yeah yeah and I think I was really, really inspired by Kwasun Nama. What is this up? Honestly, everything is screaming marriage counseling. Yeah. Everything is screaming marriage counseling. Because the very first one, husband. Did you guys even do counseling before you married? Because I hear that the marriage counseling, they actually talk about sex. They do. They talk about, like, a lot. Like, it's... Out of everything in marriage counseling, I'm like, that's the thing. I'm like, that's the thing y'all are most fo focused on. Like, sex is not the number one reason for divorce. It's money. I'm like, we need to be talking about money up in here. But yeah, they want to know, like, what kind of contraception do you want to use? Hey, that's another thing. When men get married, they don't want to use condom again. Ooh. Hey. So, but I'm like, well, five minutes will you turn into nine months of pregnancy, my dear. That's a very, <laughs> that's a very sad way to have your child if you decide to have one. Five <laughs> minutes for nine months. What kind of return on investment is this? This is that. What kind of of ROI is that? What kind of return on investment is this? Nah, I'm sending it back. I'm sending the seed money mm -hmm. back. The seed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Enter Queenies. Go back to where I'm coming from. Enter testiculus. <laughs> mm -hmm. Testiculus delitos. Yes, yes delitos. Yes. Mm -hmm. For yeah. me, it was definitely number one. I'm newly, I'm newly married. My husband and I began having sex before marriage, but it was always some quick smashing in the car. Like why yeah man mm -mm. <laughs> salem said five minutes to lifelong I yeah. mean. no 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 those days those days are over my dear or even going back to question one again since he wants to only do five minutes and roll over oh yeah put viagra in and just some juice i mean if he's hard he's hard it's if he's hard he's hard then you just ride yeah yeah you just be there for the ride mm -hmm. So maybe Sorry, that's baby steps. That's baby steps. Yeah. So you want foreplay and romance, but extend the, the you know the intercourse time with Viagra. Yes. So once you've extended that from five minutes to maybe like twenty-five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you, okay, this reminds me of a friend of mine. I swear I'm not the friend. I'm actually not the friend. Mm -hmm. But a friend of mine's husband, you know when they're like the side effects are like extended you know erection his erection lasted for eight hours and they hadn't been having sex for like for months because they could not get hard this wasn't she was writing that every hour on the hour <laughs> 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 until finally he was bleeding with air and they took him to the hospital they had to drain the blood <laughs> but every hour she was like oh i don't know what i'm <laughs> 
yeah, um, I definitely recommend Viagra so that he can't like he can't nut like he'll nut, but you know, still so hard. It's about you, so then we prioritize your pleasure. Yeah, your pleasure. Yes. Your pleasure is the. Yes. 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 And then maybe he'll go on a sex hiatus for a bit, but next time he comes, he will be gentle and take his time. Be gentle. He will then focus on the romance because he'll be so horrified. You no, know, you'd have trauma. Yes, traumatize him. Traumatize him. Traumatize him. Traumatize him. Traumatize him. Drunk him. Traumatize him. Ride him, and then wait for the romance. Exactly. Because yeah. Because you'll be scared. You'll be terrified, mm -hmm. and then like, trying to like you know bring you flowers and like anything to get your mind off the sex so like all those romantic gestures cleaning the house you know you know washing laundry, your pants washing your pants mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. pants that will brought you at the wedding to see if you're gay gay exactly that mm -hmm. very one that very one mm -hmm. man we came back and solved your problem we solved your problem girl viagra thank you little uh, blue pill i know right but, okay. on that note can you imagine an eight hour orgasm Huh? That is like a core workout for life. <laughs> <laughs> Those abdominal, I said, come on, body, beach body, be what? <laughs> beach body for what session? <laughs> it's our orgasm. <laughs> Now, I don't know about you, but I've like, I've talked about this many times. I actually die when I come. You do? I, I do. I die. Like, there's, there's a space where I, I black out. Like, I, I, I black out. There's, there's like time mm -hmm. that disappears. Yeah. I can't imagine dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. For me, for me, it's like, it takes a while. But once I do, oh my, like it, it has a different variation. One time I was like, I, I got hit by a fucking train. It's like, <laughs> is this what being hit by a moving train feels like? What the fuck just happened? So I have, I have, like, it's, um, and when it happens, like, it's, it's always, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> yeah. It's, what the fuck just happened? So, like, the micro orgasms, those little small ones, but like, when, when, when the, a friend is simple, when the one that's, it's mixed with the, the blood of Jesus. It's, it's like, it's like, I really, the Holy I, I, I've been hit by a bus or a train and it's insane. So maybe, maybe that's what dying feels like. Yeah. Kojo says coming and going. Coming and going. They're coming and going. Coming and going. Coming it's and going. After. Mm -hmm. Imagine, yeah. imagine coming and going and dying. Can't wait to break your virginity. Kojo, don't let me snitch on you. Kojo, don't <laughs> let me snitch on you. Kojo, don't let me snitch on you. Don't let me put your business out here. <laughs> Salem said, leg shaking, whole body convulsing. Yeah. 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 Yeah, no. Forgetting oh. your forgetting your date of birth. They ask you, what day were you born? You're like, the day Jesus died. <laughs> Jesus died. Did he die on Saturday? Sunday? <laughs> Tuesday? What's your mother's name? Pussy cat. <laughs> How old are now, you now? Right? Imagine it even being worse. They don't even give you the opportunity to die. They are pumping you with caffeine too. <laughs> so you are on Viagra and energy drink. So you are, you can't sleep. You are, you can't <laughs> die. Viagra and Red Bull. You are, you Your heart is boo 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 Your penis is boo 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 Yeah. Yes. We have a solution for your problem. You have ammunition now. Question number one. So your life should not be as boring anymore. At all. Mm -hmm. And Viagra is readily available. Like, because it's a male performance enhancement pill, you can get it anywhere. Exactly. You don't need a doctor to go to nothing. Even the Coco Cella. Yeah. I'm sure she has some Viagra on the side. Come on now. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Ride that yes. eight hours. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ride it. One Ride less. it. Ride it. Yes. I'll thank our audience. Mm -hmm. Yes. Us. Thank you to everyone. Please don't forget to follow Adventures From Adventures Live. The festival is happening in Nairobi, whoop, whoop, Kenya. Whoop. You better, if you need to get a sugar daddy, sugar mommy, you know, do blood ritual, whatever you need to do to get your tickets and get a, if you're not in Kenya, get a plane ticket. If you need to start walking, start walking now. It's in November, there's today. time. You, you want to see one you there. One. one. One kidney. One kidney to survive. It's fine. So please, join us.
and don't forget yep. to follow us stay tuned Saint, well next week will be on the regular time yes next regular is a regular time time so this one was 30 minutes early so yep. regular time and we mm -hmm. will see you next week send us your questions your grievances your concerns nope. and we will give you bad advice <laughs> thank you everybody for spending your sunday with us we appreciate you salem welcome thank you for your interaction <laughs> bye everyone bye.